the Attorney General Gloria Ekufu is today expected to formally open the state's case, case against former Cocoa Board CEO Dr. Stephen Opuni. He's standing trial together with businessman Seidu Agongo on charges ranging from money laundering to causing financial loss to the state. Dr. Opuni's lawyers have already filed an application demanding all documents the AG intends to rely on. Ms. Kufu has already expressed her willingness to hand those documents to him. Michael E. Komladum joins us from the law court complex. Hello, Komla. What's happening at the complex now? We know that at the previous court date, there were a lot of party supporters coming through. What's happening today? Well, Ben, is, uh, it's relatively very calm here at the law court complex. A short while ago, precisely at about 9.40 a.m., Dr. Steve Opuni, in the company of his lawyers and some relatives, walked into the law court complex. Uh, and so in a short while, we're expecting that the case will be called. But the general atmosphere is a quiet one compared to what it was on March 26, when we were here, uh, there are not exactly many people, not much activity happening here at the law court complex. Uh, security officials in terms of police, personnel, national security officials are here, but they are not in the huge numbers as we saw when we were here the last time. So it's a relatively quiet atmosphere here at the law court complex, Bernice. And I can confirm also that the former Cocoa Board boss, Dr. Stigo Puni, has just walked in and in a few minutes we expect the case to be called, Bernice. Pamela, do we know if um, the businessman, Mr. Agongo, is also in court today? Well, it is unclear. Uh, I didn't see him personally walking, but um, I suspect um, he's also going to be joining uh, Dr. Steve Opuni shortly before the case is called because we know that both of them, uh, together with the third, uh, the third party, which is their company, Agriculture Limited, are the companies or are the individuals uh, standing trial for uh, causing some financial loss to the state, according to state prosecutors. So uh, I haven't seen him personally, but I suspect that he will be joining in a few minutes for that case to be called here at the law court complex, Venice. Adam, there he's uh, in court with Joseph Akable. Joseph Akable will be hearing uh, the proceedings. Uh, he'll be sitting in the hearing of that particular case. We'll bring you updates as and when they are available.